Good morning, children. Today we're going to learn about a new mode of transportation. Can you guess what is this? Ew. It's the aeroplane. Now, aeroplane is an air transportation, which means that it goes up in the air in the sky. Now, I have made an aeroplane made out of recycled bottle, cardboards, toilet rolls, bottle caps, and you can also make your own. All you need to do is to assemble them together, do a paper mache, let it dry, and paint it. And there you go, you have your own aeroplane. Today we are going to also take a look at the different parts of the aeroplane. Now, let's first begin at the front part of the aeroplane where we can see the pilot sitting on it. The pilot is someone who flies the plane and he has to sit at the front of the plane where we call the cockpit. Can you say cockpit? Alright, now as we move on, you can see the little windows at the side of the aeroplane and these are the windows. Can you see? Windows. And this is where we will be sitting as passengers where you and I, mommy and daddy, grandma and grandpa, brothers and sisters will sit in there as we take a plane ride. So, how does a plane fly? The plane is powered by these. And these are called the engines. Can you say engines? The plane is powered by the engines so that it can fly up in the sky. But also, it needs to have wings. Alright, just like birds who can fly, they need to flap their wings and the plane also needs to have wings. Okay, so how many wings do the plane have? One, two. Two big wings at the front and at the back, you'll notice that there are also small wings. One, two, three. And we call this the stabilizers because it helps the plane to balance in the air. So, these are the different parts of the airplane, but not to forget, at the back, the airplane also have wheels. Why does the airplane have wheels if it's going to fly? Well, that's because the airplane is not always flying in the sky. Before it goes up to the sky, it needs to first take off, and when it's taking off, it needs to be at the runway. Alright? So the plane will first need the wheel so that it can drive at the runway and slowly it will take off and goes up in the sky to fly. And when the airplane is landing, it will also need the runway so that it can slowly land and go back to the runway and then park itself at the airport. So there you have it. I hope you liked the lesson with the aeroplane. 